ahead of the next governorship election in Emo State. There has been a divisive voice, and it's about zoning the governorship position to Emo East Senatorial District, popularly known as Oweri Zone. And some are calling for a governor from Oweri Zone come 2024. And while some are of the opinion that the current governor, Hopu Zodima, has done very well, and as such should have two thems to complete his good works. Speaking during the fourth anniversary of the popular equal declaration, some notable leaders from the zone are calling on all political parties to emulate Anambra. They're advising on zoning the governorship tickets to Oweri Zone. It's the fourth anniversary of the popular Ebu Declaration, the declaration that is centered on the development and the welfare of our zone, comprised the nine local government in the Senatorial District. The sons and daughters, as well as all social cultural and other groups in our zone, met on 11 November 2017 in Ebu. Oweri under the aegis of coalition of Oweri reawakening to deliberate on the worsening economy, social and political conditions facing people of the zone. Four years later, people are here again for a similar call which is aimed at making sure Oweri man becomes the governor of Imo State come 2024 governorship election. While speaking, the former governor of Imo State, Emeka Hedioha, and the current chairman of Apoga, John Iwala, said the people of Oweri Zone have sacrificed so much for other zones in the state and they should be allowed to govern the state. Oweri people of the nine local government areas, we have shown resilience, sense of responsibility, and love, and love for one another. Almighty God, I will worship. Yes. 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 Keep your eyes on the ball. The ball is the governorship of Hebrew State. Yes. 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 And our eyes will firmly remain uh, there. Some people at the event shared different views on the call. They are of the opinion that the current governor, Hopo Zodema, has done well for the people of the state and Oweri in particular, saying that he should be allowed to continue for another term. Very evident ev everywhere, and even in Oweri Zone, yeah, Oweri North, yeah, you can see the roads are being constructed and everything is working. Uh, I, for me, if I to speak, the heart of the worry will resume over the North people. They are here anymore. They are saying that this governor should continue. Because you can't stop it, you can't change a winning team. Somebody is trying to make things better. There's a there's a work in progress already. There's a prog there's a procedure, there's a process already. There is, is a, if you ask me, it's gonna be a bad thing if you're gonna stop a progressive process. I'm giving my personal opinion. opinion. Yeah. See, somebody who can will deliver. I don't care where you come from, as far as I'm concerned, should take up office and give the people what they need. At the end of the event, a communique was read out on the resolution reached at the event by Oliver Enwerem. That Oweri people, in spite of their historical advantage, have continued to make sacrifices for others. The host indigenous communities of Oweri Municipal, Oweri North and Oweri West local government areas have continued to lose most of their ancestral lands, thereby rendering them and their future generations landless. And with this resolution, perhaps the divided opinions can be merged in between. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.